What's good, everybody? It's the one and only Punch Night again. Come back to you again. This time, we're in the Vampire Masquerade Blood Hunt. And this is just some gameplay I captured last night and throughout my playtime today. Just, you know, give you a little idea of what it's like. What it looks like as far as, you know, me playing it, especially playing on PC with on uh, PS5 controller. You can see the visuals are fucking stunning. It's dark, it's gloomy, it's an ambiance of shit about to go down in it. But before I get into all of that, salute to my new subscribers. Appreciate the love support. My movement isn't the best, but I'm getting there. To my return subscribers, you already know where it is. We breaking new grounds as far as my channel is concerned because I did want to post this last year but I wasn't sure but now I'm just like fuck it you know do it <laughs> we'll have my voice over a bit here and there because I was recording it and it picked up my mic and I was also watching my show in the background and my phone was right next to me, right on top of my laptop so you can hear little bits of his stream in there too so there you go but the purpose of this battle royale is obviously survive to the end but also you feed on humans that are highlighted in purple, pink, orange red in order to get buffs the red one is to get an extra life in case you die the purple one is to get a cooldown on your i believe it's your tactical ability the orange one is get a buff on your melee ability and i believe the pink one is something to do with blood like you get you can draw more blood and your passive ability is for the blue one. And you can also execute your enemies, or you can just shoot them out, right? And it depends on your discretion on which one you choose to do. But me, I choose to like, you know, a lot of times I would just go for the kill, but as I've been playing more and more, these motherfuckers be on my deck hard as hell, pause. So it'd be difficult to ooh, snipe him, punch him, snipe that nigga. See, look, I think it's just be on my deck, just like, bro. Can you fuck off? I'm trying to do something here. What? Nah. The motherfuckers don't leave me alone for shit. <laughs> but it's all good though, cause. I'm still getting better at the game. I'm still getting a vibe of it. And, to be honest, this shit is way more fun to play as a solo player than it is to play Fortnite. Because I don't have to worry about Tony Stark's fucking um, <laughs> Iron Man suit coming to attack me. And just bombard me with missiles and bullshit like that. Or Captain America's shield. Bonking me on the head as I'm shooting somebody else. But you do have to worry about motherfuckers going invisible. You shoot them one minute and then they go invisible one minute, the next minute, and then they're behind you. It's like, it's give and take. It depends on your preference. And like, new types are not necessarily a necessity to play on. You can't be on the streets, but do be mindful that you will have to deal with the rooftop campers because I am a rooftop bitch. <laughs> bitch ass camper <laughs> on this game because I'm like, nah, bro. I'm not about to be on the ground getting sniped or popped at while I'm on the ground trying to feed on a human. Here comes some punk ass dude sniping me or with an LMG just laying waste to everything in sight. Bringing unnecessary attention to me and everybody around me because in this game It's very interesting because There's different factions that you can play as 
also they have different abilities. Well, most of the time they kind of overlap a little bit, but it's the quality of the abilities that you get to use that get better. <laughs> My flow, what? Yeah, the fucking stink bomb. I think is one of the abilities that these one of these fuckers have. I can't stand this shit. It's like. Every time I'm trying to do, almost every time I'm trying to do something, there's a bitch with a stink bomb trying to follow me. Like, can you go fuck off somewhere? That's how I feel right now. That's exactly how I feel right oh, now. Shit. Get away, get off me. Like, leave me the fuck alone. You fucking coward. Fuck you, ain't no stink bomb. But, you know. Niggas be on some bitch shit. They wait for you to get into a fight and then they show up. Me, I'm going looking for motherfuckers. Regardless if they in the fight or not. But leave it to some hoes. To do some shit like that. Especially, you know, playing against PC cowards. They be doing the absolute most to not do nothing. Until you're already doing something. But, mmm. By or may vary. It is a free to play game, so you already know there's gonna be some annoying fuckers around. But, all in all, I enjoy this game. I was playing earlier, but I was getting my shit rocked. Like, repeatedly. I'm just like, alright. It's getting to the point where I need to just sit my eyes down somewhere and go take a break. Make some videos or something, so. I eventually made this one, but I do love the vibe of the game. The shooting is je ne sais quoi. There's no real like I don't believe they're hit yeah, I believe they're hit scan, but trust me, they hit like a motherfucking truck. Yeah, they get you a variety of different weapons that you'd use. But you gotta be mindful. These motherfucking vampires be taking mad bullets. And depending on their faction, if you don't kill them outright, they can come back. Everybody can come back. We all get two lives, essentially. But certain factions, like the Bruja, they heal over time as out of combat. So you gotta just knock them niggas the fuck out. The ones I prefer playing as is the Siren, and the new one is called the Scholar. The Siren has this ability to astro project their their character. You you you'll see it throughout the gameplay here what I'm talking about. And also, they have this blinding effect ability. It's kind of like a solar flare. See, that's what I'm talking about right there. The astro projection. <laughs> Murder show, god damn it. Yep, he's speaking exactly how I feel. And that's how you execute somebody. Bullshit. Yeah, absolute bullshit. But I was getting shot at by somebody else trying to get away. I didn't have time to heal, but it is what it is. Hope you guys got something out of this. <laughs> I'm gonna leave that in. I'm gonna leave that in. That's pretty funny. But anyways, I'm done with this bitch. <laughs> god damn, I'm, oh my god. <laughs>